Time is short. We'll just take one last question before we end the session. From Al Hassan from Ghana. I work for a non-Muslim company. The company does not allow me to pray during working hours. Should I work in such a company? I mentioned my earlier session that praying salah five times is the fourth for every Muslim. There is no option, irrespective wherever he works. Even if sick for a man, he has to work. If he cannot stand, he has to sit and pray. If he cannot sit, he has to lie and pray. Even while doing jihad in the battlefield, he has to pray. One group prays, the other keeps watch. Then the second group prays, and the first group keeps a watch. There is no excuse unless you are unconscious. That is the only condition. Or you are a minor. It is accepted that you do not pray if you are an adult and if you are conscious, whether you are sick. It is compulsory to pray. If you are working in a company which does not allow you to pray, I request you go to the boss and tell, okay, please give me 10 minutes break to pray. Normally, there are two prayers that come when you work, Zohar and Asar. It's very common that Zohar Salah comes during the time of your lunch break. So surely you don't have to take permission while lunch break, when you're having a break for half an hour, 45 minutes, you have your lunch fast and then pray salah or pray salah and have your lunch fast. So surely one of your salah of zohar in any profession is easily solved and no one can prevent you from praying during your break. Regarding the other prayer asar time, there are high chances that you will be during your working hours. There may be a tea break, may not be a tea break. If it is coinciding with the working hours, go to your boss and say that please give me 10 minutes, I want to pray. Go to a nearby mosque, pray and come back. If not in the mosque, make a jamaat if there are a few Muslims in that. Go to a musalla, go to a small room, pray together. And tell the boss, okay, give me 10 minutes break, I will work 20 minutes extra. Who would say no? According to me, most of them, even the non-Muslim will agree. There may be few who will object. If your boss or if your company objects, say no, you cannot offer salah. There is no option, you have to leave the job, search for another job, you may get a job with a better salary. Even if you get a job with a lesser salary, don't worry, it will benefit you in the Akhirah and this dunya also. If you are not allowed to pray in any activity, whether it be a job or whether it be any way, sport or any other activity, what you are doing, praying five times is the fard. You have to pray. If you cannot pray in that particular job, leave the job, change your job where you can pray.